to give you guys a little update on the um, piece that you guys have just seen me working on. So this is what she looks like now. As you can see, I made the background like a lavender, and that was because the color that I originally mixed up was kind of like a red ochre kind of color. Terrible idea. Don't do that if you're painting light skin colors because every time I've painted her skin the colors seem to be like washed out or like muted because it was just a really intense orange background and I just was really struggling with trying to figure out correct values so I ended up just giving up and painting a light wash of lavender over the back so this was the initial sketch yeah there's really it's hardly an idea so I've developed there's no color in the sketch but I've developed a better idea of what I want the overall painting to look like. I don't know if you guys can even see that, but I will describe it to you. Basically, I've got like three or four different reference photos. I wanted to add in some trees over here, and then the lavender color inspired me to have her in a lavender field. So I want the lavender field to be over here, and then I kind of just want some pieces of like lavender I don't know which way I want them going. I don't know if I want them going with the hair or against the hair, but I want like some lavender, like more in detail to actually see how the lavender flower looks. Here I have written blue mixed with pink and yellow hues, so a very pretty sunset. But yeah, this gal still has a lot more work to go. I finished this painting probably like two-ish weeks ago. I just never got around to filming like the final result video. So this is it. This is the final result. I never named my pieces so I wanted to try naming this one. I'm calling her Lavender Days just because she's in a lavender field and I painted her during quarantine and I just feel like I've been in a daze during quarantine because it's just the same routine every single day. I can never tell what day it is and overall it's just a daze. So right now she lives I have a fireplace in my room and so there's a mantle around it and she lives on top of the mantle so I see her constantly. Um, so I don't I don't know if she's actually done because right now like I'm kind of just done with working on her but I can definitely see myself going back and wanting to fix this tree. But I don't really have enough practice painting trees right now so I feel like once I get more comfortable painting them I'll probably go back and fix that tree but other than that I think she's pretty much done. Okay, I can totally see where you're getting potato sack from. Okay, 
I made this romper out of a skirt. <laughs> she like, her mom works for this woman who donates clothes all the time and so we like go through them. Um, and so there was this like floor length skirt of this material and I was like, well I really wanted like a play suit, jumpsuit, romper type thing. Um, and it already has like a zipper on the side so I didn't have to worry about like doing a zipper. And so I just kind of pulled it apart and made this can't even see it. This romper thing is so bad. I didn't know how to do like the crotch region so that's just a mess. There's like kind of a pocket here just because the, it has so many layers around it. This quickly just turned into <laughs> a sewing tutorial of my outfit today. But yeah, there's like, I don't know what's going on with like these armpits here. I'm really new to sewing and I didn't have a pattern to work with or like another romper I could base it off of so this was all trial and error and I don't know I think it's kind of cute I like the back it's got like an open back I don't have to wear a bra with it I made sure that there'd be no like side slippage so all around I'm okay with it I like it anyways back to the painting what you guys are here for clearly all 13 of you guys <laughs> so yeah I don't know I might go in and fix the tree We'll see, not really sure. Um, but I did have a lot of fun painting with these little lavender flowers. I really am so bad at this. Um, I think you can see them. I don't know, I thought that they were really fun to paint. I like found a couple good references and they're really cute. I'm not sure if I completely mastered the idea of like depth and like rolling hills, but it was my first time trying to paint them. So yeah, overall, I think she's a pretty solid piece. And I like her. We'll see if I fix the tree at some point in my future. But for right now, this is how she's going to live. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that video and my romper. Um, and yeah, you'll definitely see this romper in my next video because I'm currently about to film the intro to that video right now. So, see you guys next time. Bye.